Welcome to TV News Channel. This is the current situation on Saturday, December 17th. Rescue operations. Combat. Emergency rescue teams pulled the body of a toddler from the rubble during a search for survivors before dawn in the city of Krivi Ri in central Ukraine after Russia fired 76 missiles over Ukraine on Friday in one of Moscow's biggest attacks. Mayor Ihor Tarikov said the attacks had caused huge damage to infrastructure in the Ukrainian city of Kharkiv and mainly affected the energy system. The mayor of the Ukrainian capital, Kyiv, said the system the city's metro system is back up and running and all residents have been reconnected to a water supply a day after the latest Russian airstrike. Russian state news agency TASS reported that Ukraine's shelling of a Russian-controlled village in the Luhansk region of eastern Ukraine killed at least 11 people on Friday and left 20 missing. Incident. Moscow said that their attacks were aimed at neutralizing the Ukrainian army. Ukrainians call them war crimes. The Kremlin said President Vladimir Putin sought suggestions from his armed forces commanders on how they think Russia's military operation in Ukraine should proceed during a visit to headquarters of the campaign. Diplomatic. Hungarian Foreign Minister Peter Szijjarto told Al Jazeera that winter in Ukraine would be a great tragedy. The bloc's defense body said European Union nations should buy common weapons to replenish their stockpiles after supplying Ukraine, and warned that the U.S. could not always protect Europe from threats. Insurers may refuse to cover flights to Ukraine or ships passing through the Black Sea when reinsurers, who underwriters for insurers, Proposed to exclude the area from policies from next month, four industry sources told Reuters news agency. Russia Ukraine Live News. Death toll from Krivi Ri rises to four. Rescue forces have found the body of a one year old boy from the rubble after a Russian airstrike on a residential building in the city of Krivi Ri, central Ukraine, brought the death toll to four. Ukraine's local government said air raid sirens sounded throughout Ukraine, including the capital Kyiv, a day after Russia carried out a major missile attack on critical infrastructure. President Vladimir Putin sought suggestions from his armed forces commanders on how to conduct the Russian military operation in Ukraine during a visit to the operation headquarters. The European Union's latest round of sanctions against Moscow will only exacerbate problems within the bloc, a spokesman for Russia's foreign ministry said after it decided to blacklist nearly 200 more people and ban investment in Russia's mining industry, among other steps. A shield is being set up over the used nuclear waste storage area at the Zaporizhia nuclear power plant in southern Ukraine to protect the plant from artillery and aircraft, a Russian official said. Driverless. Russia continues to launch large-scale missile attacks on Ukraine. Russia's attack targeted critical infrastructure in cities including Kyiv, Kharkiv, Krivi Ri and Zaporizhia. Russian forces fired dozens of missiles. Fires across Ukraine on Friday, causing widespread power outages, Ukrainian officials said. Gunfire from air defense systems and pounding explosions combined with air raid sirens as the attack hit critical infrastructure in cities including Kyiv, Kharkiv, Krivi Ri and Zaporizhia. The head of Ukraine's armed forces said they intercepted 60 of the 76 missiles launched. In Kyiv, city council member Senya Semenova said 60% of residents had no electricity on Friday evening and 70% no water. She said the metro system had been shut down and was unlikely to resume on Saturday. Russian attacks on electricity and water systems have occurred intermittently since mid-October increasing people's suffering as winter approaches. But the Ukrainian military has reported increasing success in shooting down rockets and drones with explosives. More than half the Russian missiles fired on Friday were aimed at Ukraine's capital. The city administration said Kyiv withstood one of the biggest rocket attacks it has faced since Russia invasion Ukraine nearly 10 months ago.
Ukrainian air defense shot down 37 of about 40 missiles that entered the city's airspace, and one person was injured, it said. In Krivi Ri, President Volodymyr Zelensky's hometown in central Ukraine, the apartment building hit by a missile had a gaping hole in its upper floors. Along with the three people killed, at least 13 were taken to the hospital, said Igor Karolin, the deputy head of the city's emergency services. Rescue teams with sniffer dogs searched through the debris for a missing mother and her 18-month-old child. Also in Krivi Ri, nearly 600 miners were stuck underground of the missile attacks, but were later rescued, Mayor Alexander Vilkel said on state TV.